Hi everyone, how are you all? I hope you all are doing great. My name is Narendra and welcome back to BTNX. Today we are diving into a practical topic that's relevant to many of us. How to create a calories tracker in Excel. Before we move forward, I would like to tell you that BTNX is offering an exclusive workshop on Microsoft Office using AI tools. The link is in the description. We'll talk more about it later in the video. Working professionals, are you using Excel, Power BI, PowerPoint or Word in your day-to-day -day life? What if I tell you that you're wasting 95% of your time while you're doing so? How so you will be asking me? Because you're not using chat GPT and AI tools while doing all of these work. Now let's get started with our Excel tutorial on building a calories tracker. First of all, why would you want to track your calories in Excel? Well, when you are trying to lose weight, maintain a healthy lifestyle, or simply become more aware of what you are eating, tracking your calories can be incredibly beneficial. In Excel, we have the power to customize our tracking system exactly to our needs. We can input data, set goals, and visualize progress, and much more. It's a versatile tool that can really empower our health journey. Now let's dive into the practical steps of setting up your calories tracker. So for this purpose, we are going to use ChatGPT. Let's ask ChatGPT to help us in creating calories tracker. As you can see, here we got the output. First of all, we have to create headers like a uh, date, meal, then calories consumed, then total calories. After that, we have to enter data. Like uh, in our typical meal contains breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks. So after that, we have to calculate the calories. So we have to calculate total calories. Then uh, we can visualize this data and we can also set goals, add notes. So we can format this as we did, right? We'll follow all these steps and we'll create a perfect calories tracker. But before that, I would like to tell you one important thing which all of you need to know. A is taking over the world in such a short span of time. We have seen so many layoffs, millions of jobs replaced by AI and whatnot. We don't want to get affected by this recession wave, right? Well, AI won't replace you, but the person using AI will. If you want to save your job and become irreplaceable in your career, join our two-hour Microsoft Office using AI Tools Workshop in which we will teach you about the best AI tools to upskill, increase your productivity, and enhance your career. Make your future secure with us. Join our workshop by clicking the link below in the description now. Alright, back to our canvas tracker. So let's build this thing. First of all, we have to create headers like date, meal, calories consumed, total calories. So let's create this. I've created the headers. Now let's enter the data like breakfast, lunch, dinner and snacks. I have added all the meals 
which we take in a day. So here I'm just going to add the date. Here we are going to add the date. So I'm going to add today's date. So let's add calories which I consumed during breakfast. So to calculate calories, we can use any other online tools or we can use ChatGPT. So we can ask uh, simply how many calories does one plate Italy have. So as you can see, so approximately 120 to 140 calories. So let's consider 140 calories for the breakfast. And for lunch, I ate uh, chicken biryani. Let's assume that. So we can ask a uh, chart GPT, how many calories does a one plate chicken biryani contains? So, it may contain uh, 300 to 500 calories per plate. So, let's assume 500 calories. For dinner, I again consumed uh, chicken biryani. So, it will be around uh, 500 calories. And for snacks, I consumed uh, mirchi bhaji. So, uh, let's consider 300 calories. To calculate how many calories I consumed in this particular day, here we are going to use a formula. So, as you can see, we got one formula here. Some, we are going to use this formula. So, we got the total, we consumed 1440 calories. So, these are not exactly what we have consumed. So, based on your uh, daily intake, we can add calories and calculate the total. So, this is how we can create a calories tracker in Excel using ChatGPT. So, we can do customizations on this like we can add a visualization thing and we can add a, a goals setting thing and we can add a, this thing also or to add notes so we can format this thing as needed so this is the basic one and there you have it by the end of this tutorial you'll have your very own calories tracker in excel ready to help you achieve your health goals before we wrap up don't forget to like comment share the video and subscribe to our youtube channel for more such informative videos also do check out our workshop link in the description we'll see you there thank you